Fantasy Football Week 14 wrap, Debo does it again. Brock Purdy threw for a career-high 368 passing yards, and Debo Samuel exploded again during the 49 ERS win Sunday. Samuel caught a long touchdown and ran in another TD while finishing as a top two fantasy WR for the second straight week. He's totaled five touchdowns over that span, becoming just the second player in NFL history with 100 plus receiving yards, a receiving TD and a rushing TD in back-to-back -back games. Samuel also now has the most rushing touchdowns, 19, ever by a wide receiver. Purdy is averaging the most yards per attempt, 9.9, .9, since the merger and 325 plus passing yards at home this season. He's just the fourth QB ever to complete at least 70% of his passes in seven consecutive games. Purdy lost a TD pass when Samuel was stopped at the one-foot line Sunday, Samuel would run in a score the next play, but he leads the league in most passing stats on a team with the number one seed right now. The competition between Purdy and Doc Prescott for the league MVP will be heated. Christian McCaffrey had a 72-yard run on the game's first play but watched Jordan Mason punch in the ensuing short score. CMC was limited to just six opportunities at halftime and 10 through three quarters, finishing with a season-low one target. McCaffrey also didn't score for just the second game all season, but he led the league with 145 rushing yards and still finished as a top 10 fantasy back this week. George Kittle has 17 touchdowns since last season with Purdy. The people's tight end totaled 20 touchdowns over the first five seasons of his career. Brandon Ayuk lost a fumble and failed to score for the first time in five games, but he's on pace to finish the season with 1,492 receiving yards. Drew Locke was solid enough in relief of Geno Smith, getting 8.7 YPA against a tough San Francisco defense. Locke found DK Metcalf, who was ejected late in the game, for a long score right after Charvarius Ward left injured. Locke later hit Colby Parkinson for a TD after a fake double screen, but Smith has until next Monday night to get healthy for a matchup versus the Eagles. Zach Charbonnet and Kenneth Walker split work during their return. Walker broke multiple tackles during a terrific 27-yard catch and run, but Seattle gets a couple of stout run defenses over the next two weeks, 5, at 10. San Francisco got 9.9 .9 yards per play, as CMC, Samuel, Ayuk, and Kittle combined for more than 500 yards. San Francisco punter Mitch Wisnowski had a 30-yard run during a fake that wasn't called by Kyle Shanahan, but it was erased thanks to a penalty that didn't affect the play.